For 30 years, the weapon for busting both bunkers and armor has been the shoulder-launched multi-purpose assault weapon, or SMAW for short. Their powerful rockets were effective, but their spotting rounds used to target enemies put the crew in harm's way. Traditional weapon systems have a spotting round, often a spotting rifle associated with that weapon that tries to match the ballistics of the missile. That takes time because the, the gunner has to get up and shoot the spotting round until he's on the target and then actually shoot the main weapon. This is time and exposure for the enemy to counterfire. Tomorrow's infantry need a weapon with a faster, less risky way of finding and engaging fortified and armored targets. A weapon like Serpent. It's a new 83 millimeter rocket launch system, effective against both bunkers and tanks, and it fires explosive rounds over 800 meters. Serpent evolves small technology by replacing its spotting rifle with a laser and thermal targeting computer for faster target acquisition. Pat Wolhoff is a former USMC chief warrant officer. With the ballistic solutions for each round built into the ballistic computer, it's all done automatically for the gunner. So all the gunner does is put the crosshairs back on target and hold them there steady and engage. At a restricted range deep in the Arizona desert, Pat is testing Serpent's ability to knock out armored vehicles. Today's target is a van, 150 yards downrange. It's reinforced with half-inch thick steel plate, typical of the armor on an enemy vehicle. The launcher is loaded with a high-explosive dual-purpose rocket. Scanning. Target acquired. Engaging. Rocket. Good shot there. Serpent has blasted clean through the steel plate.